Hello everyone, welcome to the Developers and Coders Club of NIT Agartala. Today we will discuss the football problem. One day, Vesha decided to have a look at the result of the Berlin 1910 Football Championships final. Unfortunately, he didn't uh, find the overall score of the match. However, he got uh, hold of uh, a uh, profound description of the match, uh, match process. On the whole, there are n lines in the description, each of which uh, uh, describe one goal. Every goal was marked with the name of the team that had scored it. Hal Basha learned the name of the team that won the finals. It is guaranteed that a uh, match did not end in a tie. The first line contains an integer n. The number of lines in the description, the follow n lines for each goal, the name of uh, the team that scored it. The name are non empty lines consisting uh, of uppercase case letter letters whose uh, length do not exceed 10 symbols. It is guaranteed that the match did not end in, the, in a tie or description contains no more than two different teams. Print the name of the winning team. We remind you that the uh, football team that scored more goal and the considered the winner. So now we will jump to the solution part and uh, see. Here five inputs are there. Uh, first uh, goal is uh, by A and second goal is by ABA team and third is also ABA team. Third, fourth goal is uh, uh, by the A team and fifth goal is by A team. So count of goal by A team equals to 3 and, and count of goal by ABA team equals to 2. So goal of A team uh, is more. So winner team is A team. So output is a. Now we will jump to the code part and you can see. First we will uh, make a, a string type of array and uh, store a string in this array by the for loop then we will make a temp1 string that store the first string of this array and uh, uh, we will traverse a whole array from 0 to n and uh, if we find m1 equals to equals to a string of i n string then we will count 1 plus plus for the uh, temp1 string and uh, uh, here we will uh, store the count 2 for the another string means another team and uh, after storing count 1 and count 2 we will compare uh, count 1 and count 2 if count 1 is greater than then temp 1 means first team is winner otherwise second team is winner so thank you